Hi, about two months ago I was talking to some pioneers. They were telling me about the unknown growth factor. Not unlike the dolphin fish in the ocean being the fastest growing fish in, in the world, they've been able to find this unknown growth factor in the waterways of Australia. They're able to harvest it, look after the qualities of it, sort of break it down and combine it with some other goodies to form a powerful potion that has uh, major benefits for plant food and also animal supplements. Well, I was curious about this and I wanted to do some tests myself. My name's Brett Bramble. It's a beautiful morning on my balcony here in Cremorne and I'm going to introduce you to some of the tests that I've done. Burpless cucumber. Okay, so we can see some significant difference on the right hand side compared to the left. We've got a burpless cucumber. Left is a sea sole, then sea sole a little bit stronger, and we've got aqua sole here, and we've got thrive. So these two haven't performed all that well compared to sea sole. Moving along, we've got Charlie Carp, which hasn't performed all that well either, but perhaps a little bit better than aqua sole and thrive. Then we've got the next three, which again is the the, the magic po magic fish potion and also the, uh, the the porous gravel and water crystals, and the next one's a co combination of those as well. So as you can possibly see there, there is sea salt has done a right one to three hundred, dips down from one to three hundred, or vice versa. Then there was aquasol and sea salt. Bit of a sort of downturn there. Charlie Carp's good bit of a comeback, but look at this major carp, this powerful fish based solution. Look at the, the, re the results there. In this next test is all tomatoes. It's day 11. So, as you can possibly see here, sea salt's done okay. The aquasol and thrive have been disappointing, as so has Char Charlie Carp so far. But the big winner have been the Major Carp Selenium based Magic Potion added into it has been the big winner, particularly the porous gravel and the water crystals up front. So that's the tomato experiment, we'll keep you tuned on that one. Let's have a look at the back here, we've got some uh, beans. Once again, aquasol on the left, sea salt and the major carp and kelp. What's happening here after day 15? Well, the, the aquasol in this particular case so far is, is you know, not going too bad, but it's not, not nothing out of this world. The sea salt is the middle one. That's done, done a little bit better. But the right hand side with the, the carp and kelp mix with the magic potion added into it has done significantly better, which is, uh, Quite exciting to me to tell you the truth.